All right, we're in the back of the E20 hatch now. I just kind of want to show you kind of how the back end sets up. Uh, we did have the net down. The net actually rolls up nice and neat up top. Velcro strips kind of hold that up together up top. Um, but you do have two tables like you've seen before. Um, I put one away already. I just want to show you how this one gets put away. So there is a spot underneath this bench here. You can use it for the tables. You can use it for other storage, but it's a nice place to put your tables when you're not using them. Store nice and neat. There's still room on top of those to put more accessories in there if you need to. Going back here, so you have that back together. Now, this also turns into a bed. So, I'm going to show you how to make the bed real quick. In your big pantry here, you do have pantry um, three holes to put cereals, canned goods, but in the side of it, you have three panels. So, these basically go on either end. Last one. Then you take your cushions either side. Now you have your bed set up. So a lot, a lot of sleeping space in here for a little camper. You can fit an extra two people back here. If you have little kids, you can put about three or four little ones back here. Also above here, you do have more storage. Big, nice, long cabinet door storage inside and out. And you do have your two interior speakers here too. Nice big windows. They, you can open one, this is your exit window. And there are two outlets in the back end. We just took down the bed, you've seen how that was done. Um, we're still in the back, but this is where the refrigerator is. This is your seven gallon electric gas refrigerator. The tank levels are all here where you read them from. Uh, your wider heater uh, tank right here, turn that on and you got two extra outlets. You do have two extra outlets down here. Also on the floor you have two tie downs, 1500 pounds. So if you are gonna put bikes or something, you can actually tie them down to something so they're not rattling around back here. Kayaks is good for that also. Um, you see in this storage, I'll show you again. This is where all the panels lay for your bed. And then you have your nice cupboards there. And then on the bottom, you do have another big, huge one that goes all the way to the side wall. Uh, the store more goodies in. Making our way down, you do have a nice backsplash. Um, a nice new Furion microwave we're, we're using. And your uh, two burner cooktop stove. Also, the nice big stainless steel sink. You can put all kinds of utensils, plates from outside, bring them in, wash them up. Another good thing about this one is we have four pull-out drawers. So you can take those outside, put your plates, silverware, napkins, and use those also for supplies to take in, inside, and out. Nice big storage underneath your sink. Tons of room to store pots and pans. And then another big storage area up top. This is your Furion radio, Bluetooth capable. Hook your phone up to it. You can play your Pandora, your Spotify, anything like that. Um, looking into the bathroom, we have a whole shower surround, a, pa um, a pan instead of a big tub, and a nice big uh, area for a toilet so it's not, you're not crowded at all in there. And then moving around to this other side of this wall, there is the kind of a panel for your go power generator or your inverter sorry um, to turn on and off your awning uh, in and out and then your awning lights and your interior lights and then kind of on the other side of the wall here obviously your thermostat but this is new also this comes with the off-grid package this is a bluetooth radio 
You can take it inside, outside. It has a flashlight if you need it at night. So pretty cool. And then you do have two USB ports on the side of that to charge anything else you would need. And then two more big, huge storage cabinets. So this, this is a little trailer, but you do get a lot of storage space in it. Then moving kind of to the front of the coach here, you see this nice walkway here. You got a little bit of room. These are two twin beds right now, but it will make into a big king bed. I'm going to show you how that works right now. It's just one really simple piece of wood we give you. Just slides over. And then you have your next, put your mattress down. Now you have a nice big huge king size bed. Pretty neat, simple, but a huge bed to sleep in. And you also have USB ports. You do have outlets on the other side. And without this here, you do still get a hinged storage space for more storage. So tons, tons, tons of storage in this unit. And then on top, more cabinetry, more storage for your clothes. That's all for this unit. It's the E20 Escape Hatch. Come visit us on KZ Hatch RV and happy camping.